frame up. There's no money here. able to save the reward money, but the shipment of electronic instruments was completely destroyed. That certainly won't help our reputation with the government, but they'll be afraid to use our trucks after this, especially with that uranium. Well, not necessarily. They still want you to go on moving critical supplies to the national stockpile, but they're imposing certain conditions. So from now on, all government shipping orders will be given to me, and I'll hand them out one at a time to your different companies at the last minute. Just how much business are we going to get? Well, I can't give you any details. But there's a considerable amount of refined uranium to be moved to the central stockpile. As the consignments are ready, I'll hand out shipping orders to each of you. Well, that sounds perfectly reasonable. Yes, I guess so. Well, we better get plenty of business to pay us for being treated like this. So the only shipping orders I will be able to see are the ones issued to my own company. And if we should take any of those cargoes, I would immediately be under suspicion. But I must have a supply of uranium for my foreign customer. Is there any chance of getting those schedules from Duncan? Possibly. But if we did, he'd just order them canceled, unless we had some other hold on him. What do you mean? Miss Roberts, the association secretary, is our best chance. If we were holding her prisoner, I believe Duncan would do anything we ask. How do we work it? She doesn't leave the office until after dark. So get there just before six. Now, uh, just take it easy, Miss Roberts, and you won't get hurt. Where are those government shipping schedules? Why, I don't know. Mr. Duncan has charge of them, and I don't know what he does with them. Oh, uh, well, we're going to take a look around, and you're going to help us. You better get to the office. I want to pick up my mail before Kay leaves. Suits me. Where else can we look? I tell you, I don't know. Maybe Mr. Duncan has them with him. Okay, let's go. We're going to keep you with us until somebody gives us those schedules. That's Regan and Katie. They've got Kate. No, oh, you might hit her. I'll have to trail them until we can stop the car. Step on it. this ransom letter. If you wish to see Miss Roberts again, bring duplicates of the uranium shipping schedules to apartment 27, 954 Clayton Street. Say nothing to anyone until we have time to get the uranium. Then Miss Roberts will be released. So we give them all the dope and then sit back and wait for them to hijack the stuff. Yes, and then trust them to turn Kay loose. 
Well, you gonna do it? Not quite. I'll take the papers to them, and then we'll try a trick of our own, too. Come on, I'll give you the details on the way. That's their car. Yeah, it sure is. I'll go on in and see what gives. You do your stuff and then get out of sight. Okay. Anybody with you? No. Where's Miss Roberts? We'll talk about her later. All right. What's the proposition? Give me those shipping schedules now. If they're OK, nobody bothers us. Miss Roberts will be turned loose as soon as we get the uranium. That's what you say. You better believe me. If you ever want to see that girl again. Well, I guess I'll have to. Here are the schedules. All right, you stay here till I get away. And don't get any bright ideas about following. Looks like it worked all right. Yeah, I put the calcium mine in the radiator and opened the pet cock a little. He'll be easy to track until he runs out of water. Let's get going. Schedule's all right. Nobody tried to follow me here. But my radiator's boiled dry. Fill it up for me, will you? Okay. You better leave the car here. We'll see that stuff in the radiator. If he does, they'll be expecting us. Let's circle around and try the back door. Somebody put whitewash in your radiator and then opened the pet cock. I probably figured a trailer here. Watch that door. I'll put a gag on the girl. Hold it. Drop that gun. Mr. Duncan, you've outsmarted yourself this time. You two are going to live just long enough for me to make certain that these schedules aren't phonies. Oh. 